hey what's up you guys it's emily welcome back to my channel or if you're new welcome to my channel so today i've created this look and i'm kind of doing these fast forward makeup tutorials tutorials that are kind of fast and i don't talk i just do a voiceover while showing you the products i used let me know if you guys like this way of me doing makeup tutorials or if you'd rather have me sit down and do them like talk to you like i am right now i just don't want to lose our connection in these fast makeup tutorials but you guys seem to enjoy the last makeup tutorial i did so i thought i'd do another one so i hope you guys enjoy it okay? and i hope you have a great day or night whenever you're watching and i will see you guys next time bye Okay, so the first thing we are going to do is prime our eyes. I'm using my Tarte Shape Tape on a concealer brush, and I'm just putting that all over my lid. And then I'm going to go in with the NYX Ultimate Palette with this really pretty yellow color, and I'm going to put that all over the top of my crease, and that'll be our first transition color. And then I'm going to go in with this deeper honey color, and I'm going to put that right below. Now I'm going to take the opposite side of that blending brush and I am going to blend the two colors together. And then I'm gonna take my Anastasia Beverly Hills Modern Renaissance palette and take the color Real Gar. And this is going to kind of deepen our look. So I'm just focusing this mostly on the outer V. And then once again, I really wanna blend all of this out. So I'm taking a lot of time to blend Real Gar in with the two colors from the NYX palette. And this is just once again on a big fluffy brush. So now I'm just cleaning up the edges with a concealer brush. Okay, so now I am cutting the crease. I'm taking a very fine um, eyeshadow brush and I am just putting my concealer all over my eye. And I do apologize because I kept going out of frame for this part. And now I am taking the first yellow shade that we used from the NYX palette and I am connecting Real Gar to the cut crease and just blending the two together. And once again I am cutting this crease with a very fine precise brush and the Tarte Shape Tape. And then I am going to connect Real Gar with the cut crease like the other side. So now I'm going in with the NYX Jumbo Eye Pencil in the color Milk and I'm just going over the cut crease with this color on a very fine precise brush and I just really want to intensify the cut crease because it'll come into play later on in the makeup look. So now I'm taking the Too Faced Glitter Bomb Eye Palette and I'm going to take this white color and I'm just going to pack that on where I put the NYX Jumbo Eye Pencil and this will just help bring out the white color that I'm going for and just make the eyes pop. Okay so now I'm taking the Revlon Skinny Liquid Eyeliner and I'm just going to create a bold wing following the eyeshadow line. And I apologize for the lack of footage on this. With the cut crease and the eyeliner, I kept going out of frame for some reason. So I'm going to keep that in mind next time when I film. But I hope you guys can see what I'm doing a little bit at least. So now I'm going to use my telescopic mascara by L'Oreal. And I'm going to coat my top and bottom lashes. And then I'm going to go back in with the NYX Jumbo Palette and line my lower lash line. And then I'm taking a fine brush and putting that honey color on the very bottom of my lash line. And then I'm going to put it on my Eyelore lashes. I apologize, I don't know the exact make of these because I threw the box away and I can't go get new ones because quarantine. But yeah, I just definitely know that they are Eyelore and I love them and hopefully one day I can find out the make so I can tell you guys. Oh, 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 